I really hadn't taken my faith on as my own until college and started studying the Bible and praying and went to, um, you know, women's studies and all of those things and was learning how to seek him, how to ask him because my focus had been on all of these other worldly things. I danced growing up and all of that. But as I realized that this pull was happening, you know, how do you combat that, I guess? And I learned, well, to memorize scripture, first of all, and then to speak scripture out loud, especially in those moments where I recognize that I'm falling into fear, tempting to fear, or I'm unsure about something. I'll say, you know, God did not give me a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. Amen. (laughs) And I've been known to say, get behind me, Satan. I trust in Jesus. And that's in those moments where I just know, like it's something that the enemy is trying to put in my mind, on me, whatever. So speaking it out loud. And then also repenting, being quick to repent to my children or my husband if I do sin against them, if I do find myself in anger and stopping to pray, stop and pray, especially with my kids, because, you know, as a mom, there can be those moments where all of a sudden you're like, this is a chaotic moment. How have we gotten to this place? Yeah. And it's like, okay, just stop. We're going to pray. Yeah. And it just 